Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode two of season two of Goblin Slayers. Let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one, go. I don't think so. We're, we're gonna start small. Yeah. There goes my dog. If one dog goes, they all go. Damn, wine is good. I just gotta drink it. I mean, I get it. You know, normally people want some hard shit, but I'm like, oh. <laughs> My damn dog. <laughs> Oh. He's still drinking. Oh, my God.
Well, what do you want her to do? You know, I mean, I like him, but he's a little annoying. He just, he has always something, like, bad to say. Like, damn, kid. You can't go in head first. The, the freaking negative Nancy over here and his bullshit. Sir, alrighty, goddamn. Oh shit. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> They're probably dead. I hate to be a negative Nancy about that, but yeah, but nine out of ten, they probably dead. They, they probably had no names either, so dead. <laughs> Do not- Oh my god. Yeah, but don't be reckless though! And if it's a trap and you get hurt, what are you gonna do? Oh, was that head? This damn kid, I swear to God.
Did you see the fact that she had fucking nails on her hands? Oh, she got hella tortured. Shut up! <laughs> Hell no. Nah. Well, yeah, he's fine. Oh. Just terrified. Fucking terrified. Ooh. Like, right in the damn eye. <laughs> The gore. Oh, I need that today. <laughs> you might need to take over for her. Not once again know who he is. Oh, damn. Right on the head, too. Oh, all the gore. Like, yes. I really feel bad for anybody who dates me and watches horror movies. <laughs> Damn, <laughs> that's why he daddy, though. Fucking daddy. <laughs> Don't be, once again, a negative Nancy, kid. Damn. Looking like a damn Karen. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> That's going to be his new nickname, Karen. <laughs> Except it's not Karen, it's Ken. <laughs> You okay, though? Yeah, you kind of regret saying that, huh? Oh, now you want to say you're sorry.
What the? Right. <laughs> oh, <laughs> mm. nice, good old clean cut. Oh, nice. Mm. Once again, nice, good, clean door. Yes. Mm -hmm. Happy girl. He, he being a fucking kid again. This kid with the goddamn red hair. But you did good today, so you definitely deserve something. Right? Be proud of that, because you could have died at any fucking moment, kid. Sure, kid, sure. You tried your best, but you still did good. Here we go. Negative motherfucking Nancy over here again. This changes everything now.
This fucking changes everything now. Oh my. Oh, just. Are you fucking kidding me? Why did it have to be someone he was related to that she worked with out of all the fucking people? Oh, fuck. And then if she tells him she was there and she was too scared to do anything? Oh, my God. I can now see why he had so much anger from last week to this week. Oh, shit. He's still a negative Nancy, though. I'm sorry. Like, yeah, he's a kid and all. And, you know, majority of kids have, like, the <laughs> negative, no more positive influence and such. And you want to give them the benefit of the doubt because they're kids. <laughs> and, you know, of course, kids don't know any better. But, like, this kid, and, and I get it, he's just, like, wanting to get revenge for his sister because his sister was everything to him. But, like. Oh. Her. I was not, I don't think any of us was expecting that today. But now that we know, and now that she knows who the fuck he's talking about, like, yeah, it's about to be really awkward these next couple of weeks with these two. Like, it's already messed up how, like, okay. The way this season started, of course, they're showing the flat the flashback of season one, or really the first episode and such, up until, you know, Goblin Slayer saved her. And now, every I feel like every single episode, we're getting, you know, flashbacks to all three of them with her. You know, I, I don't know how to feel, because, like, oh, I don't want, like, because I get it, she's still, in a way, and it kind of was, like, the one episode of season one, I don't know what episode it was, where... Baby had seriously PTSD. And you can see that she still has it in this, especially with all the flashbacks that she's getting from these two episodes. And so it just makes me wonder if there's going to be... Excuse me. If there's going to be a moment where she really tenses up and she's not able to, quote-unquote, be a leader. It, I mean, it kind happened in this episode but something tells me it's going to be like a really bad life or death situation um where somebody is really seriously going to get very very badly injured or possibly die but I feel like with this cast and with these group of characters no one might die but you know you can't really say never say never because of this series H hello hold on yes I am almost done. No, I'm already at the end of the episode now. Okay. Bye. Bye. <laughs> I'm sorry. Because, of course, I'm thinking no one's going to make a call me at, like, 8.43 in the, after, in the night. But, yeah, like, I, I really hope that the priestess is just calm, cool, and collected. But with the redhead kid, she he's going to bring out so much from her. Um, I'm glad that, you know, he survived his first adventure. I'm glad he ain't die. I mean, because, you know, he has a reason to be here and such. But something kind of tells me, because of the fact is he, he looks, or no, he, he's the type of kid, yeah, he is the type of kid who looks before he leaps. If something instantly happens, because we've already seen it with this episode, he is immediately like, boom, let's go. Fuck it. You've already gotten into a situation where you almost fucking died. You opened up a trap. You had the goblins, like, come up on you. And then you run after to go save the girl, and then you're surrounded by goblins again. Bro, you in a life or death situation. You've had several near-death experiences. You in the wrong field, my boy. But he he's going to try his best. But the fact is that he refuses to acknowledge Cobham Slayer. Like, I don't like that. I don't like that. So hopefully, maybe it takes some time. That's what it's going to do. It's going to take some fucking time. 
He gonna acknowledge him. Yes, mark my fucking words. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction for you towards episode two of season two of Goblin Slayer. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Friday for episode three. Bye, guys.